Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. The dish of the day is a very healthy chicken breast with parsley and coriander leaves. You can eat it on its own or with plain rice. This dish is so easy to make and it's uh, so delicious and very healthy. I am going to combine parsley and coriander leaves. I am showing you now what's the difference between coriander and parsley. First is the smell and the appearance. Parsley has a harder stem, uh, thicker skin and leaves, while coriander has a softer and thinner skin, but both can be eaten fresh or cooked. Most of the time they are being included in the salads, especially in the Mediterranean cuisine. So these vegetables are abundant in Cyprus. It's actually readily available in any uh, market, supermarkets or wet market. So we will start now. First is, of course, you have to clean the vegetables very well with the water. Coriander and parsley are very aromatic herbs. I'm gonna cut them into thinly slices. We will use two chicken breasts. Yes, it's very big. We will slice it into thin strips. The reason is for it to get cooked very quickly. When the chicken is cooked, it usually turns white in color. And make sure that the chicken is thoroughly cooked before you include the parsley and coriander since this vegetable does not require so much time to cook. It's, it only requires uh, a few minutes and then you can uh, remove it uh, from fire. That's why we add it at the last stage of cooking. Now I'm going to cut the chicken very thinly as thin as you can Okay, we finished cutting the chicken. Now let's do, uh, let's cut the onion, dice it. Okay, uh, let's heat the pan and put olive oil. I usually put olive oil in about uh, three tablespoons. Okay, when the oil is hot you can include uh, the onions let it uh, fry until it's become, it becomes translucent yes just mix it thoroughly and when it becomes translucent if uh, you can uh, you notice that um, I'm fast forwarding it often so we don't have to wait so long until the onions are cooked okay let's add one chicken stock cube let it uh, fry it's uh, I always put the uh, chicken chicken stock cube because it adds more flavor to the dish than uh, salt. But I'll, I'm going to add a salt later on. Depends on, you have to check how salty you want the dish is. Okay, now we're putting in the chicken. Okay, I add about another two tablespoons of olive oil because we have a lot of chicken in the pan. 
it will become too dry or it might stick to the pan if there's very little oil in it. I'm going to add about half tablespoon of salt to taste. If you remember earlier on, I put one uh, cube of chicken stock cube. And now I'm putting uh, some, some more salt. Well, I've been uh, cooking this many times, so I know more or less how much salt I should put in the, in the dish. Once the chicken is uh, cooked, we can add now the parsley and coriander together. Uh, this uh, will require very quickly to cook, so... I'm going to use two spatula to mix them together. It's way easier. Okay, once the chicken and the parsley and coriander are mixed completely together, uh, it will require only about a minute and then you can remove it from heat. It's ready, the dish. Here it is. I'm going to eat it with plain rice. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel. I will keep on posting more dishes. By the way, this dish is a Chinese inspired but I changed it to my own version. This is a very easy to make. I'm sure you can do it too. Anyway, thank you for watching. See you again. Thank you.